Welcome back. If I use phrases like Baja Blast or Dorito Loco Taco or how about a beefy five layer burrito, some Taco Bell fan in your house, friends, just really perked up. And good news for those of you who live or work or play on the west side of town that Taco Bell that burned up is rising from the ashes. Courtney Chandler with the story. How often do you come to Taco Bell here? Uh, maybe twice a week. Uh, quite often. Now that we have to come over here, probably once every couple of weeks. And that's because this Taco Bell on Ross Court Circle had to close its doors. Since that Taco Bell was burglarized and burned out almost one year ago, many people here in Dalton have made the location here on West Main Street their new home. But that location on Ross Court Circle will soon reopen, and we are glad they won't have to drive far to live moss and think outside the bun. Instead of coming all the way this side of town, I see I my work over on the south side of town, and mm -hmm. it's a lot closer to the other Taco Bell is. Extremely excited. Extremely excited. <laughs> yeah, because that's the one we normally ate at all the time. Really? It's closer to the house, and it's better than coming across town. It's closer to my house, so it'll save me some gas. But one customer just hopes that he won't have to do this. You can go to a computer and have to order and then go to a counter and pay. Why can't you just go to a counter and pay and order at the same time? These computers, they're kind of taking jobs away from people. If you take the computers out, you'll get more jobs and more people will actually want to go there instead of seeing a computer and walking back out. Keep it in local and Dothan. Courtney Chandler, WDHN News 18. Garrett's not feeling the computers there, but no need to fear. Those on the west side can go south of the border coming up very soon in Dothan. <laughs>